Yum! Cardboard. Hello to all my supporters out there and potential last minute supporters of the world's first cardboard action figure series, the birth of an entirely new product segment. The campaign is on its very last day, ending on September 29th at 12 noon. This final video is to wrap things up, show you the final product, and to let you know what you're going to be part of. This is what you'll get once the campaign ends and I mail everything out, come November. Using Usagi Ojimbo as my supermodel here, the box is pretty much the same as what I showed in the images and video at the start of this campaign, but the extra feature is the removable glass window. This is real glass protecting the figurine. The glass slides in and out from a side opening. When shipped, it'll have a taped barrier on the side to prevent the movement and it will be shipped with extensive bubble wrap so it won't break while in the shipping process. Each figuring box will have pegs implanted inside to keep the toy in one position. I want to make sure it doesn't move around and get damaged when it ships. And here's the back of the box with info about the character and images of all the other heroes in the set, giving the feel of a standard action figure blister that shows who else there is to collect. And of course, they come signed and numbered by me. Because the campaign reached its stretch goal, each back row received one display easel so you could showcase your character anywhere you want once you take out of the box. You don't have to put on the fridge or any magnetic surface, it could sit right on the desk. And you also get your choice of one suction cup magnetic car decal to express yourself as you drive. A survey will be sent after the campaign ends so you can make your choice of which one you want. Now, I want all of you to know what happens next after the campaign ends. These additions here, as part of the whole set, are being completed as we speak and will be shipped out to the character creators first. I can't say thank you enough to all the creators who allowed me to launch my first cardboard action figure series using their characters. In their packages, when they get these figurines, there will be copies of the different box images for them to sign and then send back to me in the envelope that will accompany the packages. The signed images or box images will be made into the finished boxes for the backers. So that is how my backers will get the packages signed by the creators and signed by me. Thank you to everyone who backed an individual character. I have to say a special thank you to David of Pop Culture Canada for supporting all the characters in this first launch. Pop Culture Canada does such good work in the community and I look forward to attending your combo conventions again. Respect to Editable Polly for getting involved and supporting the bulk of these figurines. You are awesome, my friend, and you will love what you receive. Trust me on that. And Usagi Ojimbo fans, I have no words that could properly convey or describe your dedication to Stan Sakai's character and your support of this figurine. You immediately saw my Usagi Ojimbo figurine as a premium investment and a collectible, and I will do my best to get them signed for you. This is an uphill battle of introducing a new product category that's never existed before. For the month I've been running this campaign, I've been showered with compliments and praise by so many people. This campaign has gotten in blog mentions and has been featured on podcasts. However, I've also heard from people who still can't get past the idea of quote-unquote cardboard collectibles. They love the artistry and design and the work that I put into them. The general public understands comic books, the general public understands action figures, but comic book action figures made by hand out of cardboard is still very niche for many people. They don't get it, but you know what? I dig it. But I also believe fully that everything happens for a reason. Every new idea goes through this. And you respect those who see what others don't. This set will end and will never be reproduced. But this is the dawn of my handmade cardboard action figurines. I've just begun. During this campaign, I've been approached by seven other indie combo publishers to take their characters and make them into my toys. Plus, I've already started talking to four big-name creators to make figurines based on their characters. They saw Nira X, Usagi Ojimbo, and Mr. Monster, those additions I made. They were impressed, and now we're discussing doing the same for their mainstream characters. Therefore, I'm looking to make a series 2 of this concept with brand new characters for either Christmas 2020 or for the Comic-Con season in early next year. After this campaign is done, I'll be launching a completely separate handmade action figure series. It has nothing to do with comic books. And it will be somewhat controversial as hell, and the media will eat it up. And I will use that media attention to point back towards this first launch. I'm excited for what is to come, and for you, my supporters, you should be too. I am building a new brand and creating a new collectible product category from scratch. 
Just like the Mego Corporation created the modern day collectible superhero action figure back in the early 70s and how Funko made vinyl toys sought after collectibles, it's on my shoulders to make cardboard action figures the next big rare item. I know this is going to sound hyperbolic, perhaps even arrogant on my part, but all of my supporters for this Kickstarter campaign, you are part of comic book and toy history and you will come to realize this and understand it in the years to come. So to my supporters, be confident. You're one of 38 people who will be very happy with what you will receive and the future values that they will hold. If you've seen the mass media coverage I have received over just the past six months for my various inventions, then you know I will work non-stop until I know your figurines are worth bank. These are investments and I want them to be that way for you. I'm just getting started with this new market segment. The best is yet to come. Thank you again. And if anyone watching this who is on the fence and has been moved by my words, you can still jump on board. You have until 12 noon on the 29th tomorrow. Cheers to everyone. Stay safe out there. It's time to cross the finish line and make some killer handmade comic book action figure art. I'm hyped and I'm looking forward to it.